Just a word on David Cottrell. He scored a stunning goal uh, midweek. What's that going to do for his confidence? Because he's been in and out of the team this season, uh, especially after a, a season like last season as well. Um, it's going to do wonders for his confidence, that goal, isn't it? Yeah, well, it will. And it Cots is as somebody as a person and as a player I've got a lot, a lot of time for. You know, we, um, we chat a lot one to one, and David knows what I expect of him. He knows that I've got a lot of belief in him as well. And um, like most wingers, and not just David, they're confidence players. You know, and that goal will do the world, the world a good because there's there's not many players in this league that could score that goal. Um, David's one of them. Bolton away this weekend. Are you surprised at where they are this season? Yeah, I am. Um, Dougie's somebody I know really, really well. Um, going back to, you know, when he was in the youth team at QPR and I was in the youth team at, at Arsenal. So we've known each other a long time and he's got a talented squad there. You know, he, he turned them around last season. Um, by their own admission, they'll probably admit they're, they're not where they want to be at the minute. Um, but although they've just lost their last two games, they've, they've shown people already this season what they're capable of because they've went eight games unbeaten before that. You know, and the run they had towards the end of last season but they nearly got in the playoffs as well. Um, so th they've got a good squad, you know, so the league position they're in at the minute, we won't we won't be looking too much into that because we know they've got good players and a good manager. You're going there with a lot of confidence there really, aren't you? You're a bit of momentum, take away the Charlton game and you've got a good, good run of results. Yeah, we have and, you know, going back to what I just said previously, it's, it's about staying in the game, you know, even if you look back to the Yeovil game, it, it won all way with ten men, you know, we went on to win the game and um, that breeds confidence in itself, you know, coming from behind in the last two games and picking up points. It lets the players believe that after a three really bad results, you know, in the Middlesbrough game and the Reading game and the Brighton game, um, it gives them a lot of belief that they can compete in this division.